Hey everyone, my name is Tony Bob. Welcome back to Dev Support. If you're looking to use video for your sales and marketing strategy, you're in the right place. In today's video, we'll do a side-by-side -side comparison between Bomb Bomb and Dub. If you've been going back and forth between the two, this video should clear up any questions you have so you can make a confident business decision. So let's get right to it. The first thing we're gonna talk about is creation tools. When you go to create your video, you want it to be as simple as possible. I don't know about you, but I'm not very technical and I'd like to spend more of my time building relationships than trying to figure out a new application. And if I wanna get the most value out of something, I want to be able to go on there and just have a really easy user experience. Darius is gonna walk us through the user experience between BombBomb Bomb and Dubs, Chrome extension and desktop applications. And we'll point out some pretty big differences between the two so you could make a decision that's best for you and your technical abilities. So Darius, take it from here. So the first thing here is the Chrome extension. You can see they actually both have a Chrome extension, but they are quite different. The main difference being that with BombBombs, you're actually having to download a desktop-based recorder. And when you want to launch a screen recording, you're actually having to open and launch a separate application like so. I'm going to jump in here real quick. So in order to use the screen recorder with BombBomb, you have to download an 80 plus megabyte desktop app to your computer. I'm not sure about you, but I'm not a big fan of downloading apps that are going to possibly slow down my computer. When it comes to using the screen recorder for Dub, you can access it directly from the website and the Chrome extension only. Okay, Darius, back to you. So now we're actually ready to record the screen with the BombBomb Bomb screen recorder. You can see though that there's just not quite the same functionality. We don't have the annotation tool, so we can't annotate the screen. There's also no pause option here. Looks like the only things are resizing the camera or turning off the camera. That's about it. Okay, now we're gonna check out the Dub Chrome extension. You're gonna see here that this is a little bit more advanced and the good news is no pop-ups. So when you're ready to record, all you have to do is click the Dub icon in your browser and start recording. Also, Dub is a true Chrome-based recorder. Darius is gonna get into the details now. Take it from here. So here's the Dub Chrome extension and how it works. Just give it a click. Don't have to launch the desktop recorder. It activates right here inside of Chrome. Three, two, one, we're recording. We can come in here and say, click here for this or sign here for this or whatever we need to do during that. We can also resize the webcam and say, hey, this part's really important and even pause the video right in the middle of the presentation in case we need to change gears or switch our train of thoughts or wherever we're doing. Thanks a lot, Darius. Now I'm gonna talk about why adding annotations to your video production can add huge value. Whether you're adding text such as subtitles like this or captions such as this or this, adding annotations to your video helps to keep people engaged in watching your videos. The longer they watch your videos, the more they're gonna learn about your products and services and hopefully click on one of your CTAs. This helps with brand awareness and gets people in your sales funnels. Here's a quick recap. With BombBomb, Bomb, you have a desktop application that you have to download onto your computer. With Dub, you have a Chrome-based application and a desktop application that easily allows you to access your recorder, do real-time editing, and add annotations. I'm gonna to have to say that Dub takes the edge on this one. Now we're gonna talk about the Gmail add-ons for BombBomb Bomb and Dub. It's important that you can send your emails via the Gmail servers because this helps with email deliverability. This also helps to decrease your bounce back rates and spam and ultimately helps to increase your open rates, which everyone wants when it comes to email marketing. Now Darius is gonna walk us through the difference between the Gmail add-on with BombBomb Bomb and Dub. Now here's the Gmail add-ons for both BombBomb Bomb and Dub. You can see when we hit Compose, they both have a little tool inside of there. BombBomb Bomb has their Power Wheel tool here, and Dub has just the one button, a little bit less intrusive, down in the bottom of the toolbar that when you click it, gives you access to your library, your activity reporting, all the same things that BombBomb provides, just in a different interface. BombBomb Bomb also has this column here on the right-hand side, as well as this drop-down menu here in the top. So you can see overall the functionality is almost identical. One just has a couple more little visible options here in the menu as compared to Dub's small item in the tool tray. If you're looking for a comparison between two specific features, we've included timestamps below so you can jump right to that part in the video. Now we're gonna talk about the add-ons and integrations between BombBomb Bomb and Dub. As you can see, I added on this sweatshirt to my ensemble to prove a very important point. 
When you go to add something onto your current outfit, you wanna make sure two things, right? That it's a good fit and that it's functional. Now, the same thing goes for when you're adding new software to your current business systems and software. You wanna make sure that the process is gonna be seamless and it's also going to integrate easily with your other systems that you have already operating, such as your CRM or your email platform. This is important because if you do not have this accessibility, it can actually cause a lot of chaos within your business. So pay attention because Darius is gonna go over the difference between BombBombs integrations and Dubs integrations to make sure you choose the right one for your existing business model and software systems. As far as this goes, yeah, not fitting and not functional at all. <laughs> not, losing it, losing it, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna jump in here real quick because LinkedIn is one of the largest professional networks in the world. It contributes to over 80% of B2B leads. So if you're already using it, you're gonna love the integration that Dub has for LinkedIn. And if you're not, I would highly recommend getting a profile on there because it's a great place to start using video. Now, Darius is gonna show us the LinkedIn integration within Dub. Here's how the integration works with LinkedIn. There's actually gonna be a Dub button right inside of Messages, inside of Sales Navigator, inside of LinkedIn Recruiter. Everywhere you can leave a message inside of LinkedIn, you can instantly attach a Dub video. Instant access to your library, recording, and even activity reporting right inside of LinkedIn. And when you insert these videos, it does show as the animated preview, as the GIF, and also the link to the video. Thanks a lot, Darius. I hope this helps you choose the platform that's gonna work best for your current business needs. Okay, it's time to get into the fun stuff. The customization tools, in my opinion, is one of the most important factors when creating videos that convert especially if you're trying to build a brand and leave an impression on your viewers. Darius is gonna get into the details and talk you through how you can add branding aspects such as logos and custom colors in the Dub platform right now. So here are some of the ways that Dub allows you to customize your videos and video pages. First thing is subtitles. You can either use Dub to automatically or manually generate subtitles for each of your videos. You can also trim your videos any point in your video that you want to trim out, whether it's the beginning, middle, multiple parts of the video, all you have to do is select the time frames you want to trim and then remove them. You can also instantly customize your video pages with what we call presets. You can see here this video has a background, playlist of videos, and call to action buttons, and this is instantly customizable using the preset feature. So you can see here, if I change the preset, it instantly changes all the assets on the page, including the playlist, the button colors, the buttons themselves, the background, the entire page. If I have as many different presets as I need to use, I can instantly apply them and it's gonna modify that landing page immediately. This is also done by default. So if you record a video, all of these elements are added automatically. BombBomb Bomb currently does not support SRT files or closed captions. So with regards to video editing, Dub is going to have the advantage here. Now back to Darius, he's gonna get into the email templates and the video pages. Let's talk about email templates and video page templates. So the first thing is both platforms do offer the ability to create customized email templates. So they both have little visual builders like this where you can automatically make your email template the way you want to so that when it actually shows up in the body of an email, it'll be customized and look how you want. You can see here Dubs is almost identical. So on the other hand side, one of the main differences is your logo and your social icons are automatically populated as part of the templates here on Dub. There's a dozen or so preloaded templates within there. Um, BombBomb Bomb doesn't have any built pre-built templates in their dashboard. They do offer a service where you can pay per custom template to a couple hundred bucks. So here is the visual builders in the email. Now this is where the similarities kind of end because with BombBomb, Bomb, when you're designing this template, this same layout here is what shows up within the body of the email and also what shows up on the video page. So they're seeing basically the same thing twice here. They get the preview of the template in there, and if they click to watch the video, they're shown that same template here where there are some customization options available on this page. 
So that is the way that BombBomb works. With Dub, the way that it works, when you're creating this email template, that's what will show up within the body of the email like this. So it's almost the same, except for with Dub, it's a little bit different because when you're clicking here, you are taken to the custom video landing page, which you can see has a completely different kind of look and feel than what the email template does itself. The playlist is a feature here that BombBomb does not offer. It's a very powerful feature that enables your videos to play back to back. Of course, the call to action buttons. These are the main differences between the video page between BombBomb and Dub, as well as some subtitles. The main difference between these two is the way that these video pages gets built. So with BombBomb, as you saw, you're custom creating that template for each video page. And with Dub, this entire video page gets built automatically based on your preset. I'm just gonna jump in here real quick to emphasize the importance of having everything on one page, including a way for people to schedule appointments with you or to purchase your product. When people have to start looking for a way to get in touch with you or they have to call you, there's a likelihood that you're going to lose them or they're gonna drop off the current action that they're doing. So keeping everything on one page is really important to getting that person to the next step in the sales funnel. Okay, Darius, back to you. So you can see here's a video that I recorded and if I apply a preset, it instantly changes every part of that video page from the top to the bottom, including the background, the theme, the colors, the video playlist, and even the call to actions. So that's the primary difference between the video pages here with Dub and BombBomb is Dub allows you to have a recipe of instant video landing page templates as well as email templates. Whereas with BombBomb, the email template and the video page template are the same. Here's a quick recap. When it comes to video pages, Dub takes the lead. With regards to templates, they're equal, but Dub has the ability to auto-populate your social media links and your brand elements, which is pretty cool. Overall, when it comes to customization tools, I'd have to say that Dub takes the edge because of their advanced video page functionality. This includes their CTAs, their brand elements, the ability to have playlists and integrate your calendar all into your video page. Now we're gonna get into distribution and automation. I can't stress enough how important automation is to a business of any size. This enables you to literally get leads or make money in your sleep. In addition, email marketing contributes to over 122% of ROI. That's four times any other digital marketing channel. You own your email list, which is important if any of your social media channels were to shut down, you would be able to still contact your potential clients and current clients. Darius is now gonna walk us through the comparisons between BombBomb and Dub's distribution and automation features. Now let's talk about distribution and automation. So both platforms do have the ability to send out bulk video email campaigns. This is what this looks like with BombBomb. You start with your video and then you build your template and then you send it out to a list of contacts. So this is where they have some differences though. The way that BombBomb's email sender works is they have their own proprietary senders, something like MailChimp, where you're sending through BombBomb's email servers. And there is a certain number of emails you can send depending on the package you're on. Now with Dub, you can see here the builder's really pretty similar. You're building, you click the video, then you're putting in the body, and then you're choosing the recipients, and then you're sending it or scheduling it for later. So in terms of procedure, it's almost identical. But the way that the email sender itself works is you have multiple options for a broadcast provider. So actually who's sending the email? So you can see here with Dub, you can directly connect your Gmail or your Outlook or any SMTP provider. And then when you're sending a bulk video email, it's actually going through your email provider instead of a BombBomb type server or MailChimp or something like that. So that's the main difference between the campaign functionality here is when you're sending out bulk video emails through the service itself, with Dub you're using an SMTP provider like Gmail or Outlook or Amazon like we have here. And with BombBomb, you're using BombBomb's proprietary email server. So there is plus and minus to either of these, positive and negatives. So the idea with sending through your own personal Gmail is you can end up being much more likely to end up in the inbox versus the promotions tab. Whereas if you're sending from like a MailChimp or BombBomb server, you're more likely to end up in the promotions due to the nature of the server itself. 
However, the on the downside, you probably won't be able to send as many through like a free Gmail or Outlook account as you would 3,500 on the bomb bomb limit. If you have a paid G Suite account, you'll be able to send at least 3,000 per month, so they're pretty close. And as far as SMTP providers like Amazon here, we can send tens of thousands per month or day. Um, there's much, much higher limits on other providers besides Gmail. Outlook even has a much higher sending limit than Gmail itself. So, okay, so that's the main difference between the distribution in bulk video emails. And that's also really where the similarities end because in addition to sending emails, Dub also allows you to send bulk video text messages. So you can directly connect your Twilio or Amazon or any provider and you can send out bulk video text messages from Dub. You can't do any type of bulk texting from BombBomb. Now, in addition to bulk texting, there's also automation or workflows. Now, BombBomb did used to have workflows available on lower plans. They only are available now on their higher tiered plans. So workflows won't be available to new BombBomb users unless you're on the highest tiered plan. It's like two grand or something. So with Dub's workflows, however, with Dub, the email sequences are gonna be a lot more advanced. You can have them be emails or text messages or both, and the way in which the automations can be built are much more complicated. So instead of just a simple delay of like a day or a week or whatever time, we can add complex variables such as if then statements, we can automatically create deals or tasks or remove or add tags, create new campaigns based on if they watch videos or click CTAs. So very complex automation is possible using Dub's automation. So this is, again, a major difference between BombBomb and Dub is the level of automation available as well as the SMS bulk and automated capabilities. Here's a quick recap. When it comes to BombBomb and Dub, both have in-house sending capabilities. The biggest difference is Dub is more advanced when it comes to automation and its complex workflows. In order to have automation integrated into your system with BombBomb, you have to have the legacy plan, which starts at $2,000 a year. Money, 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 money. It's time to talk about pricing, folks. Whether you're a growing startup or an established corporation, it's important that you're getting a good ROI with your marketing efforts. And when you choose a new platform to work with it, they're gonna grow and scale with you. Darius is going to get into the details of the different pricing options when it comes to BombBomb and Dove. So let's get into it. The first thing is the free trial. Both plans do offer a free trial where you'll have access to most of the features that the platforms offer. However, when the free trials expired, there is not a free version of BombBomb while there is a free or starter version of Dub. It does include Dub branding and it doesn't have access to all the powerful features that are included with the paid plan, but there is a free option available. The next lineup is the $29 BombBomb Essentials plan, which is basically a Gmail add-on. It doesn't have access to all of the features of BombBomb like the built-in sending functionality. Now with Dub, there's a similar plan, which is basically the internal and support plan, which is around $10 per month or $8 if you pay for the year in advance. And now this is going to be similar in regards that it doesn't have the built-in sending capabilities. You do have the ability to create a branded video with a call to action below it. So quite similar in terms of functionality from the support flow pro to the essential plan here. Now, really where things get interesting is the, the pro plans, the main plans that both platforms offer, because this is where you get the bulk of the features that the platforms are offering. So with BombBomb, we're looking at BombBomb Plus, which is $49 per month or $499 per year if you pay for the year in advance. So this is their plan that includes most everything of what they have to offer. However, if you are considering a solution of five or more users, then you're looking at the enterprise plan, which does have some of its very own unique features, just like you'll have with Dub for Teams as well. More on that in one second. So you can see here, actually, even with the $49 plan, there are a handful of things that you still do not have access to, such as lead gen forms and automation, like we talked about. So when comparing the $49 plan, with the plan at Dub. The $40 plan here at Dub does include everything that the platform has to offer except for automations. Automations and a dedicated account rep that one-on-one -on -one support is available in the Pro Plus plan, which is either $960 per year or $100 per month. So this would be a more equivalent to the enterprise plans or the legacy plan with BombBomb, which is not listed here on this page because it's under their 
team account there, it's going to be an enterprise solution for them that includes some of that more support. The one on one coaching is listed here. So that is the main difference there is the you need five or more users to get the enterprise support there, whereas you can be by the pro plus plan here with dub and that'll include that same level of support and automation, or you can have access to the pro plan on a team level and add automation as an add on for only $40 per month. So any way you slice it, dub is going to be significantly less expensive. There's also significant price breaks involved when you're considering multiple users. So if you have a team of five or more users and you're considering a comparison here, definitely give Dub a chat and we'll be able to give you a really competitive price point for what you're looking for. I'm sure you have a lot running through your mind right now. So I'm going to give you three main takeaways to consider to help you to make your decision between BombBomb and Dub. But if you're looking for more advanced video production, like adding custom text, brand elements such as logos, music, or even subtitles, then Dub might be the way to go. The second one is automation. Remember with Dub, you get more advanced automation and complex workflows. And with BombBomb, you cannot access their automation tools until you have their legacy plan, which starts at $2,000 a year. The third one is integrations. Remember, these are so important. And in here, you wanna consider your industry as well. If you're focused in sales and marketing and you're already active on LinkedIn, you might wanna consider Dub, especially for that LinkedIn integration. I hope this helps you. Check, check the mic, it's time to start the show. Are you ready to rap and get in flow? When I rock the mic, I rock the mic, right? So grab your beats and let's go, go, go. Oh, wrong show. Shameless plug here, guys. Hey, if you're looking to get more tips about dub and in an entertaining way, make sure you check out our show, The Daily Dub. Thanks so much for joining us today. I hope this video was helpful in making a choice between Bomb Bomb and Dub. If you like this content, consider giving us a thumbs up and subscribing if you want to see more videos like this. And if you want to check out those cool features from Dub, all you have to do is go to dub.com and get your free account there to get started. This is Tony Bub with Dub Support. Until next time, continue using video for your sales and marketing strategy. Mike out. <laughs>